Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. Mm, grilled cheese, a Jamie Jarosik favorite there. I bet we'll know where we'll find her. All right, 7 o'clock, 37 degrees, cloudy skies, 36 at 9 p.m., 36 at 11 o'clock with those cloudy conditions out there. Now, there may be a sprinkle or a flake or two of snow, but basically we're looking at a dry forecast here into the start of the weekend. Still a lot of cloud cover around tomorrow, maybe a couple of peaks of sunshine, upper 30s at noon, once again around 40 in the afternoon, starting off the day close to that freezing mark. In November, it was a warm one, well above normal temperatures. We ended up 4.4 degrees above the average temperature of 47.2, way on the dry side. Of course, we saw a lot of sunshine in November. Usually that doesn't happen. We were 2.3 inches below normal, and we did tie the record for the month, almost hit 80 for the first time ever. All the way back there on the first a month ago, we uh, tied the record for the month at 79 degrees, and the minimum 24 degrees, which occurred on the 22nd. We expect a lot of cloud cover around again on Friday, chilly right on through the weekend. A dry Saturday, but by Sunday, a chance of some rain showers in the afternoon. We're still waiting for our first measurable snowfall. We had a trace of snow in the month of November, but uh, December 8th is our average one inch or more for the first, seeing the first one inch of snowfall in the winter season. And it does look like we'll start to turn colder toward that time frame. The average snow for the month of December, four and a half inches and 7.9, the average snowfall for January. A look at the forecast lows tonight, close to that freeze. Mark for us, low 30s across much of western Ohio. Stall vision camera tonight, dry conditions in Beaver Creek. A chilly one out there, though, with those temperatures in the 30s tonight. We're looking at Oak Street, Wyoming Street, down toward the fairground, the Great Miami River, UD Arena. Seeing dry weather tonight and all across uh, our region today, it's been mostly dry. We've seen a few blips on the radar scope up into Logan and Champaign counties where we have had a couple of light sprinkles, a couple of flakes of snow possible, but otherwise, the main story, overcast skies extending back west into Illinois. Southern edge of the cloud deck, right there it is, southern Indiana, northern Kentucky, trying to creep northward tonight, but it's going to have a tough time doing it over the next two days. We're currently 38 degrees with a west wind at 14, dew point down to 27, wind chill factor at 30. Our weather checkers tonight, upper 30s to right around 40. Barbara Richards and Kettering, the warmest number we have tonight there at 40 degrees. Our future track forecast map, not much to see here. Just just a lot of cloud cover hanging around, cold air settling over the Great Lakes and the Ohio Valley. Maybe some breaks in the clouds tomorrow, but a better chance of seeing the return of some of that sunshine for Saturday as that area of high pressure gets a little bit closer to us as we go through the day. However, the clouds will return for Saturday night. Could see some showers building back into the region on Sunday. Mostly cloudy, cold tonight, down to 32 degrees. Tomorrow will be up around 40 with those clouds still hanging tough. West winds at 10 to 15. 35 at 10 o'clock, 38 degrees at noon, upper 30s to near 40 in the afternoon. Saturday's high 43 with a mix of clouds and sunshine. A chance of some rain showers on Sunday, primarily afternoon hours. Into the upper 40s on Monday, a chance of rain again on Tuesday. Not a bad day Wednesday, up into the 50s there, but that's before a cold front comes through with falling temperatures on Thursday. Maybe some early day showers, maybe a snow flurry later in the day. I can't believe it's December. It's here. We're not far from Christmas now. Where has the year gone? All right.